Holy crap, Lois. I almost got scammed again by a meme coin that promised to make me a millionaire in two hours, but only left me with a bag of worthless tokens and the tears of a man who lost his paycheck. So listen up. I'm going to give you the ultimate no-nonsense guide on how to spot these meme coin scams before some faceless dev runs off with our hard-earned money. You got to know the signs, or you're just handing your cash to some joker. First off, red flags that a meme coin is a scam. Explain like I'm ranting over a beer at the drunken clam. Number one, if the liquidity isn't locked, it's like someone offering you a sandwich but keeping the meat, and all you get is the damn bread. No locked liquidity means the devs can pull all the money out and leave you hanging like quagmire after a bad date. Next, if the market cap is higher than the liquidity. Warning! That's like saying my gut is worth more than the beer inside it. Total BS. You want the liquidity to back up the market cap or it's just a house of cards that'll collapse the second you peek at the price charts. And then there are the honeypots, those sneaky tokens that let you buy but not sell. It's like when I try to return Quagmire's bootleg DVD of Fast and Furious 27 inches and he's already changed the locks. You'll be stuck with useless tokens while the dev is sipping margaritas on a beach. Now how to investigate like a true meme coin degenerate. First, check if the contract has malicious functions. If the code has more traps than a quagmire date, run for the hills. Look out for sneaky code that lets devs blacklist you or freeze your tokens. Check the big holders. If one guy owns 50% of the tokens, it's like letting Chris control the TV remote disaster waiting to happen. That whale can dump any time and crush your dreams faster than Meg's social life. Also watch for bundle scams when you pay more in fees than the tokens are worth like when I invest in potty pies and end up losing more in taxes than gains. High fees to buy or sell mean the devs are just robbing you blind. Finally, tips to avoid crying like Stewie when his teddy gets taken away. Always use tools like Dex Tools, Rug Screen, or Token Sniffer. Or you'll be more vulnerable than Meg in a popularity contest. If the team is anonymous and promises Lambos in a week, it's shadier than Herbert offering candy to neighborhood kids. Nothing good comes from mystery devs with big promises but no track record. And remember, do your own research. Because trusting a meme of a dog and sunglasses is as smart as letting Brian drive sober. Look into the chemistry of the project before you throw your paycheck away. Or you'll end up like me, crying over another scam with a warm beer in hand. So there you go, my ultimate guide to meme coin scams. Follow these and maybe your wallet won't be empty by next weekend. Cheers to the...